Hey, HAA, I'm Casey Morgan, HAA CEO, and today is March 1st. It's day at the Capitol. We brought around 100 members from HAA to the state Capitol to meet with our Houston area delegation. And I'm really excited to share this with you. We've got some interviews with members and legislators, so let's go inside the Capitol and see what our HAA members are up to. Candace, thanks for joining us from AAA Plumbers. We really appreciate you being a part of today. Tell us a little bit about why it's important from a supplier's point of view to be a part of Day at the Capitol. Sometimes there may not be a direct link to the policies that we're talking about because they may not affect your bottom line like they affect our owner or management members, but why is it still important for suppliers to participate? We are servicing the communities in which these uh, legislative issues are being presented. And so in order to well represent our customers and our, the communities that we service, I feel like we need a better understanding of what they're going through. We wanna be able to lobby on their behalf and be a voice for them as well to come out in numbers together. We're back, and this time I have Christy Rodriguez, HAA past president with Jedwin Properties. Christy, I wanted to ask you, now that we're here at Day at the Capitol, why from an owner management perspective is it important for our industry to engage with legislators? Absolutely, great question. So Texas Apartment Association represents four out of 10 households in our great state. It's so important that we're here um, to advocate on behalf of our industry because our whole mission is to provide quality rental housing at affordable rates. And by doing this today and being here as one, one industry, one voice, we're doing exactly that. We're moving forward towards that mission. I was hoping that you would be able to comment on why it's important for industry stakeholders to come to the state capitol and visit with their legislators on industry issues. Yeah, that's a great question. And the easy answer is we work for you. And we want to be your voice. We're expected to be your voice. And we can't advocate on your behalf if we don't know what's important to that specific industry. So we always encourage everybody to come to the capitol and have your voice heard. What do you hope the members that are participating today in the Day at the Capitol learn from this experience? Great question. You know I'm super passionate about people. Um, I lead from the heart and I really, truly, honestly believe that today is an opportunity to form connections. I've been serving in this association for many years and some of the people that I serve with, I've known longer than I've known my husband. So it's so important that you take this opportunity to really form that bond um, and understand understand that we're all together, our industry is our livelihood, and that we're all together as one. And I am now here with HAA's current president, Stephanie Graves, with Q10, and I wanted to ask Stephanie, since we are at the Capitol right now, I know that you are very committed to education and advocacy, mm -hmm. so why is it important, in your opinion, for members of HAA to participate in a day like today? I look at it this way. I think us being here and supporting what, what we do and making sure that we have a voice in what's happening in this building, that's what we need to do as an association, right? Everything that they think about and do, they need to know that we care about it and we can help them be educated about those issues. So that's why advocacy is so important. We've got to make sure that they know what's happening in our industry because these people don't know, right? Senator Whitmire, thank you for sitting down with us the longest serving senator in the Senate, so we appreciate your time. Sure. We're here today to participate in our day at the Capitol. Why would you say it's important for industry stakeholders to come and meet with their legislators and meet with you about industry issues? Well, this is one of the processes you can use to interact with your state government and visit your state capital, which hopefully will motivate your members to, to remain involved in your association and go back and, and uh, register and vote and, and stay involved. Uh, you know, we only meet every other year, so uh, state government is not as well covered as, say, the city or county or even the feds. So it's a, it's, it's a easy access way to be accessible to your state rep and state mm -hmm. centers. You know, I used to at lunches, I'd ask people, well, let's go over here and tell me who your state rep and senator is, but I quit doing it because it embarrassed people. 
because they just don't want them. So through your efforts and your day at the Capitol, um, you know, I just met with constituents that are your members, so that's the way it starts and hopefully it'll motivate them. I get to hear their views, so it's just, it makes the system work. What do you hope is the biggest takeaway for HAA members from participating today? Passion for what we're doing, right? Really having a voice and understanding that you can have a voice in what's happening in this building. And even if you're not passing a bill or even if you're not, you know, you're not involved in that, what we do is representing the greater good of, of the organization.